Hi guys, we are continuing our collection and declutter videos. And today is all about the highlighters. Welcome or welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Andy and I'm really happy that you're here. So yes, we are doing our highlighters today. I have two different things of highlighters. Yeah, so these are like, I have one that are loose highlighters and cream highlighters and all of that stuff. And then I have another one that is all of my like little highlighter compact type things. So we're gonna start with this one. We're gonna start with this one. And we're gonna go for the ColourPop Over the Moon Super Shock Cheek. Um, it is very pretty. I did recently hit pan in it. And you can see the shift on that. It is so pretty. Oh my gosh, I hope you guys can see that. So pretty. It reminds me, it's like the cheek version or the highlighter version of the Mountain Lion Super Shop, which is my fave. Okay, now let's do some loose highlighters. And this is the Wet n Wild You Glow Girl. And this is a pink, like a pink toned, and I love it. I absolutely love this. Um, I think this is the one I've had the longest, and I love it. And we have the Cab Cosmetics, K-A-B Cosmetics, and this is the Illuminating Dust in Beam. I did get this in friend mail from Laura the Bargain Hunter, and I love it. It's a beautiful goldy champagne shade. And then I just recently got this, and this is in the shade Clio, and this is the Nubian Loose Highlighter by Juvia's Place. I just got this, so I have not used it yet. It is still sealed and I probably won't open it for a little while um, because I have other ones that are like this that are open. Um, the Cab Cosmetics, it might be a little bit darker than the Cab, but it's really pretty. Really pretty. I'm going to keep that, of course. I don't know how many of these I'm getting rid of. All right. This is a Glamazon stick and unfortunately it's broken like this fell out in here and I probably wouldn't use it much anyway. So that's getting thrown out. Then we have the Statement Skin. <coughs> this is So Susan Statement Skin Highlighting Crayon. It's really pretty. I actually like to use this on my brow bone. Um, it's actually broken in there, but so far, it's been okay. Next, we have the Pacifica. These are the Rainbow Crystals Liquid Mineral Strobe. And I use, I've used this quite a bit too. And that is beautiful. Obviously, you blend it out. But it's such a pretty finish. And it's showing all the texture on my old wrinkly hands. All right. This is Light Odyssey Highlighting Stick. From So Susan. Yeah, So Susan. This is still in here because I haven't used it at all. I did swatch it, but it's really pretty. It's like a peachy. Be great for with a tan. If you had a tan, oh my gosh, that would be beautiful. I'm gonna throw that box away. And then the last thing is the Lumiere. And this is from So Susan also. And this was this is a rose gold liquid highlighter and it's just in that tube right there it's really pretty it's a nice it's more pinky gold than like it's it's not really rose gold all right now we have this this is she glam yeah she glam glitter wizard invisible jelly shadow now i think this is probably yeah this is all dried up and i'm not even going to touch that it is all dried up and crusty I actually bought this for my best friend, Dina. Um, she had a showcase at uh, the Arnold, which is a, the Arnold is uh, like a fitness symposium. It's Arnold Schwarzenegger. It's his fitness symposium um, in Columbus, here in Columbus every year. And she had a routine that she was doing. And so I bought this that she, that she could use it, but then she actually found some other stuff that she liked. So that's getting thrown away. And then I have this little guy, which he doesn't really belong in this one, but I have this little guy. And this is the Laura Geller Diamond Dust, and this is 
so pretty. This is so pretty. I love it. This is one of my favorite highlighters. Okay, you guys, now we're going to the other one. Yes, I know. It's it's a lot. It's a lot. That's why that's why she gets her own video. They get their own video. All right. Now. This is the Jelly Pom Pom Cosmetics Metallic Cream Highlighter Palette. Um, I think you guys have seen this, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure you've seen this, where I got this. Uh, I almost didn't swatch it because I was like, I don't know. And I wish I wouldn't have, because this are really weird. I mean, it's a cream, but like, they're really pretty. But I just don't know. I don't, I mean, honestly, I don't know if I'll ever use them. They're very pretty. They are. But I don't know why I even swatched it, because I really don't like a cream highlighter to begin with throw away that box. And then I have this little Kinder Glow palette. It's pretty. I haven't used it. Uh, it's pretty to look at. I haven't used it yet. Um, but it, I mean, I'm keeping it. Um, but I have not used it yet. And then I recently, in my Wonderlust uh, spooky box, I got this highlighter illuminator. And this is from the Balm. Sustainably Gorgeous. Oh, it's got one of those weird things. And that's what it looks like. It's very pretty. It's a very natural, natural highlight. And I like that. But I don't always want to be seen from the moon. You know what I'm saying? All right. We're going to do... We're going to do my soul. Um, color pop, soul body. Shimmering body powders. Here's this one. And this one's huge. Oh, I think they all have that still on the top. So it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. I love it. It's a very pretty, very pretty finish. This is called Bronze Hour. This came with the, um, the, the bug collection. And that's really pretty. And then this one came with the, this was the dragonfly part of the collection. This is the firefly part of the collection. This is called starlight. This is wildflower honey. This came with the bee palette and oh my gosh, so, so pretty, such a pretty finish. And then the last one, is called soft pink and it is a very light very light pinky pinky shade okay next up are both from essence and one is a one is called a highlighter and this is called a sunlighter and this is called be my sunlight and it's a little darker than the highlighter but they both give just such a really it's not as dark as a bronzer though they just give a really nice, natural, like lit within, lit from within glow. And I like them a lot. Those are one of my favorite uh, bronzers for just a natural, natural look. And then I have the Concha from Glam Light. And this is a purpley. Um, this is a little dusty. Like uh, I have to buff it down a little bit, but it's very very pretty. Love it. The Nomad Sydney Bathers. It is called Balmoral Beach. You guys, this is so pretty. Very natural. It's a very natural highlight, but it is so flippin' pretty. Oh my gosh, I love it. And next up is my Batman highlighter from Revolution. And uh, I love this this highlighter. And not just because it's Batman, but it gives a really pretty glow. And I love it. I love the shade. Let's see if we can do this without blinding you guys. 
It is so pretty. It's very natural. Very natural looking. I love it. This is my chromosome from She Glam. This is very uh, seen from Mars type thing. This is a very bright, very bright, and I don't know if you can, I can actually see that, but there's a, a shift to it, and oh my gosh, it's, when I put it on, it's like, whoa, I forgot, I forgot that that does that. Only special occasions where I want to look a little extra, guys, a little extra. And then we have this Anastasia of Beverly Hills. This is the Iced Out Highlighter. And oh my gosh, this is stunning. Um, my nail did go in it when I was putting it away last time. Um, I barely used it because it, it's so pretty. I don't want to use it. It's so pretty. But it is a gorgeous, gorgeous champagne type highlight. This is the Jaclyn Cosmetics highlighter, and this is in the shade Sparks, and the S, the, the S is a dollar sign. It's beautiful. It is a gold. It's a really pretty light gold. Oh my gosh, it is gorgeous. I actually wore this tonight when I went to dinner with my man. And then we have couple left. This is the Huda Beauty and this is the Nymph Kiss Glow Blush in Thea, T-H-E-I-A. And this is probably my favorite. And it is beautiful. You guys, it is so pretty. Oh my gosh, it is gorgeous and I love it. I love this so, so much. And then one more. It's a little duo. And this is Laura Geller. And I did get this in the Laura Geller mystery box uh, about a year ago. High Def Glow Illuminating Duo Heart of Gold. It's in Shimmer and Sparkle. That is Shimmer. That is Sparkle. Right? Yeah, that is Shimmer. That is Sparkle. It kind of looks like it should be the opposite way. But that's very pretty. I've used this a few times. And it is very, very pretty gold highlight. I like this in the summer, but also around Christmas time where you want that kind of gold look. But in the summer, I like a gold look as opposed to um, more of a cool look. I don't know why you guys, I just do. And then this is the last one. I thought the other one was the last one, but then this was in the wrong place. So this is the Michaela Glam Light and it is so freaking stunning. It is such a pretty, pretty highlighter. I love it so much. And I don't even know why I love highlighters so much. I do though. I love highlighters. Not as much as I love eyeshadow palettes, but pretty close. Like I love highlighters and I don't know what it is. I honestly don't know what it is because I don't wear them very often. I think I need to. I think I need to start doing which, if I said, if I do, if I start like a 10 uses or a 20 uses or something like that so that I can work through my products, um, I think that's a really good idea. Okay, you guys, thank you guys so much for joining me for my highlighter collection video. If you haven't seen any of the other collection videos, um, there will be the playlist listed in the description box below. It has my palette collection and declutters. It has foundation concealer, primers, blushes, bronzers, powders, all of that. All of that. So if you're interested, go check that out. And I really appreciate being here. And until our next adventure, everyone have a great day and we'll see you later.